Hi everyone, it's Miss Kelty for my Friday update. I am so excited for all our ECDC um, alum who are graduating from Franklin High tonight. It is so fun for us because we have um, high school kids, seniors who have come to ECDC and who are um, staying in Franklin Public Schools and graduating from Franklin, come back and get their picture taken in front of the sign. And it's so nice to be able to see them do that, but also to then connect some of the teachers with them too. It's, um, it's, it's great to see the, the whole trajectory of Franklin Public School students. Um, just a couple updates today. Um, it was hot these last couple days and we want to remind you to dress in layers. We do have air conditioning throughout the building, um, but sometimes it can be chilly. So make sure your kiddos have a sweater and make sure they're also able to take that sweater off and be um, nice and cool if it gets too warm in here. Um, students continue to play outside, which is so fun in this weather. But just so you know, we still follow the same guidelines when it gets too hot. Um, we watch for, um, just like we do in the cold, there are certain, there's a certain feels like threshold that we just won't play outside because it isn't safe to do so. The garden's starting to get planted. I'm really excited. I just have to um, dig out the two little, um, we have two, they're really two planters between the arch that um, grass has really grown in. So we need to dig those out and put some soil in and then we'll put climbers up there. Um, so we'll put peas up there, we'll put cucumbers up there. We're excited for that. Um, so again, keep watching the garden. That's always fun. Coming up, um, reminder, the last day of school is either the um, 13th or the 14th, depending on which days your child comes to school. And then the 15th is our ECDC fun fair. That is so much fun and we hope to see you there. Um, I did just get off the phone with Paula Morano, who, as you know, is the assistant superintendent um, in charge of student services. And she is um, really has a big role here at ECDC. And she is spearheading the um, search to find a new um, principal for this great school. She is sending out a message to all of you to um, get see if anyone's interested in joining on the committee. Um, they do have, um, they have a timeline. You'll see all that in the message. And, you know, she's asked my opinion. This is a decision that um, the school community needs to make, but I have provided my ideas and thoughts as much as I could. But again, um, it's a decision you as a community, you with the teachers, together you need to make this. The committee that Paul is looking for has a very finite timeline. So if you can make it, reach out to her, you can be on that. There'll just be a couple parent representatives there and then there'll be an opportunity for you to meet with the one or two candidates that they bring forward um, for visits. Um, you'll have an opportunity to meet with them. I think that might be virtually, I'm not sure, but for those of you who ha who aren't on the committee but still want to have a voice in this process. Um, so again, I'm really hopeful and I'm excited for, for what's next for this wonderful school. I hope you have a great weekend and we will see you next week. Bye.